Therefore, we have not grown our assets in uh, our OC branches. Who would have NPA? The NPA is having on the rise in the first two quarters, and in the last two quarters, we have taken various initiatives due to which our stipendias have been contained. We have taken enormous efforts at the field level to improve our cash recovery, upgradation, and we have also been active in sale to ARC, which have helped in reducing our NPA. Net NPA stands at 9,813 as against 5,658 of 2014. And although in absolute terms, uh, accretion to NPAs have been on the rise, for the last two quarters, we have, our NPAs have started sliding. See, one Im uh, important uh, indication uh, achievement which we have done in the last two quarters is we have concentrated on improving the provision coverage ratio. The provision coverage ratio for the last quarter is at 50.92, which was only 50.03 in Q3, that is December quarter. So our efforts were uh, directed only towards improving the provision coverage. The next uh, um, this slide deals with cost of deposits. You will find you see cost of deposits has been coming down in Q4 1415. The cost of deposits has come down to 7.50. We have uh, taken uh, systematic measures to shed high cost deposits and we have also been cautious in uh, taking only assets which are capital light. Therefore, our yield on advances also will be improving in the coming quarters with these measures. Cost to income ratio has come down due to our reduction in the uh, overall establishment cost, staff cost and operational cost. CASA ratio, as I told you, for, um, CASA ratio stands at 25.09% for Q4 14 NIM stands at 1.87. We have uh, here valuations, earnings per share, book value per share, artistic book value, and price to book value. See, these uh, uh, valuations have been under pressure in the last uh, six months due to our last situation. Nevertheless, we are confident that our valuations will improve once our earnings are now started improving. On the capital front, uh, we have taken steps to improve the tier 1 capital. In February, we have gone for additional tier 1 bonds perpetual addition tier on bonds for about 1,000 crore. So therefore, we feel there is no uh, immediate pressure on the capital, considering the fact that uh, the credit growth will also be muted in the current year. Our CRA is well above the regulatory minimum. So we'll be shortly uploading on our website a detailed presentation. And now uh, our MD will be interacting with you on the details you have on the performance. Thank you. I just try to supplement to what our CFO said. Though the bank was uh, incurring losses for two quarters, Q2 and Q3, in Q4 the bank has done a tremendous job on the recovery front. The bank has recovered around 700, 780 crores as cash recovery only in this quarter. Plus, a lot of operations also took place. As a result of which, you would have seen that we tried to rein in the level of NPA. The NPA level has not grown very high. We could contain it, and there was an additional, uh, I would say, amount of quantum added to NPA was hardly some 300 400 crores. We are also trying to control our expenses. And going forward, our focus will be on the recovery, plus upgradation, plus prevention of slippages in the future, more, of more and more cost of deposits, and focus towards retail and SME sectors in the current year, current financial year. Our CRAR is also much about 
the requirement stipulated by RDI. And we also have a headroom of nearly 1,600 crores in tier 2 capital, which we will be trying to mop up during the current year. So going forward, I believe the bank will be in a better direction. On the technology front also, the bank is trying to change the CDS platform to the latest state-of-the-art technology which is likely to be implemented by end of the year or the beginning of next calendar year, maximum. And with all this, I believe the bank is on the growth trajectory in the coming days. Coupled with that, let me add that we in our IOB have one of the latest, uh, best of the art, again, best state of the art technologies for post missions that is point of sale, mobile point of sale they launch, which is very, very user friendly, which we are trying to increase to a figure of at least 8 to 10,000 by year end. And all these things we expect, that is the new implementation of CBS, that is this cost machines and the host of features that we are going to try to bring out for customers, uh, going to help us in improving the CASA by this financial year end. So with this, let me open the floor to all of you for raising any questions that you feel that we have left out to address in our presentation and my talk. Thank you. What would you attribute the huge loss to? Sorry? What would you attribute the huge loss? I mean, huge you know, loss? Yeah. The year-end fiscal, I mean, it's still in the red. Sorry, that's all because of the accumulated NPS. There was a huge NPS figures in the earlier quarters, I think you must be having the figures. So no, once the classic account is in PA. Statistics uh, is not okay here. We didn't even give last year's uh, profit or whatever. So I mean, the balance not be uploaded our website because mm -hmm. just today. No, no, when you give a press release, let it have all these uh, okay. details, you know. Why should we wait for your uploading? What if it doesn't work? Okay, we don't, we'll see that it's all done. Sir, that's uh, while sequentially you turned around, you know, last two quarters was a net loss and now profit. But year on year still, you know, there's a huge gap for the fourth, fourth quarter. There's been a drop in the net profit. So what is the reason? Is it still the NPA? Obviously, you see, the first two quarters, the, the second and third quarter, accumulated loss is so much that it was difficult for us to wipe off the entire thing in one quarter. So it will take some time. Sorry? 9,020 when? It was 13,40. That is opening, opening, opening. Okay. And now? Now it is 14,922. So what is the fresh slippages? Because sir said the incremental slippages have been lower this quarter, both the... Uh, it is in comparison to the December 